John here. Welcome to part 8 of my OpenSCAD tutorial. Today we're talking about uh, the three-dimensional Boolean operations. So these are the union, the intersection, and the difference of solid shapes. Let's make these fonts a little bigger to read. Okay, so let's say we have a cube. It's 20 on a side. And we have a sphere whose radius is 20. Two of these things combined like this, we would call this an implied union, because it is the sum total of the volume of both of these shapes combined. So there is an implied union. Oops. Union. This is now an explicit union. So no no difference yet, nothing uh, visually striking about that. It's just a formal uh, formalism in this context. We'll see in a minute where this becomes uh, necessary. Let's look at the difference between this cube and this sphere. What do we have now? We, the difference is defined as the first child object of the difference minus all the subsequent objects. So this is the cube minus that sphere, and that kind of makes sense. Take the volume of the cube and remove the volume of the sphere, all right? Now these can have more than two child objects in there. Let's say we got a cylinder. Now we remove this sphere and this cylinder from the cube, all right? And you can just keep combining these however you want. Now the uh, intersection, let's look at the intersection of these things. This is almost the opposite, not quite, but almost the opposite of the difference. All right, so what is an intersection? This is the part that is the cube and the cylinder and the sphere. Wherever those three things uh, intersect in, in in their volumes is what's left. So let's go ahead and highlight these guys, right? Turn on the debugging highlight. So there's the the contribution of the cylinder. You can definitely see the cu the cube's contribution in there. All right. You can also highlight both of these if you really wanted to. So there's your cylinder. There's your cube, and we might as well turn on the sphere as well. So all three of these, you can sort of see how you ultimately end up with only this part right inside there is the intersection of those three. So that's the definition of an intersection then. Okay. Go ahead and turn the debug back off. So now let's go back to difference. Cube minus sphere minus cylinder. Okay. Here's where an, a, a union can come in handy. What if you didn't want to subtract the sphere and the cylinder from the cube? Instead, you want to subtract the cylinder from the combination, the union of the sphere and the cube together. You end up with this. So now you can see the union, the effect of the union of the sphere and the cube, and the subtraction, the difference of the cylinder. All right, so this is a case where you definitely want to use an explicit union because these two things need to be treated as one child object of the difference. So that's one of the times this becomes uh, very useful. So there you have the 3D Boolean operations, your difference, your union, and your intersection.